I just put the development here, and this is part 6 of Tic-Tac-Toe iPhone game tutorial. If you haven't watched uh, part, the parts from 1 to 5, links will be in the descriptions. Okay, and uh, we should have finished uh, here with the void, void display winner. Uh, but I have found uh, some error mistakes that I have made in part 5. Bull check for win should look so like something like that. It, sh it lo used to look like that, but you should fix it with... There should not be the curly bracket. It should be like that. Okay, now we're gonna code... Uh, I think we're done with the display winner. Yeah, we are. And now we're gonna implement the IB action. Oh, sorry guys. Uh, our, as you remember, our IB action is named button reset. IB action uh, button uh, reset. Okay. Uh, open square break itself. Reset board. Okay. Now we're gonna create a void. Reset board void. Uh, void reset board. Okay. Press enter about 20 times. Now we're gonna clear the images stored in UI image view. S1 uh, dot image. Uh, sorry for my par parrots. They're kind of they're kind of loud. S two dot image dot null. S three S three dot image equals null. S four dot image null. Can okay, I'll just copy and paste that? Copy and paste. It should be S5, S6, S7, S8, S9 dot image equals to null. Okay, this basically means that there will be no images stored in the UI image view. Now player token resets the player token. You do it like player token equals to one, and uh, whose turn dot text uh, x can go now we'll reset number of plays, number of plays equals zero. As you remember, this is a player token. It means that we're gonna start player one will start again and we'll reset uh, the label text a number of places will be zero as you know if number of places is equal to nine it automatically resets and it means that a uh, draw uh, no one won okay now we'll create another void statement uh, void update player info Okay, tap enter about 20 times. And, okay. Number of place. Plus, plus. If. Number of place. If number of place equals 9. Game is draw. Draw. Self reset board. Self reset board. Okay. Now, if player token equals equals one, player token 
equals two. This means that if player token is one, player to then player token will be two. Uh, whose text? Oh, sorry. Whose turn? Dot text equals. Oh, can go. Okay, and now else. Else. Player token equals one. Whose turn dot text x can uh, go? Okay, this basically means if we tap uh, one of your image views, player if player token is one, player token will be two, and whose turn dot text will be, will say is o can go, and else if player if player token is two. Player token will be is one, and whose turn that text uh, is x. As you know, one or two, one means I think x, and two means o. It's just numerical string of uh, player one or player two or whatever you call it, x or now. Now, uh, uncomment void did receive memory memory of warning. Now go to void dialog, dialog, s1 release, will release all these images, s2 release, uh, s3 release, s4 release, s5 release, now s6 release basically this code will release all these image views s8 release Nine release okay another image uh, the image a release release reset button release Release okay. Uh, whose turn? Release my alert view. Release basically, this code will release all of this uh, interface, all of these outlets that we have created up here. It will just will it will release all these outlets. Okay, we're done coding. Now I'll build save all. Okay, and we've got two errors. Case I forgot. Okay, it's just little error. And no errors. As you see, we haven't done anything in interface builder yet. And. Uh, uh, this was part six of Tic Tac Toe iPhone game iPhone game tutorial. Please watch part six. In the part six, we're going to be creating the interface. And and remember, if you haven't created the images yet, you have to have one three hundred by three hundred image and two uh, uh, one hundred by one hundred pixels image. Thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe. Goodbye.